How? Do you think you're how? It's very like, feel powerful next to him. Today's grooming session is something really unique. We have got a special guest. Meet Ash, our very own wolf client. He's a Northern Inuit, the same breed often chosen to portray wolves on television. Ash is here for a full groom, and let me tell you, he is shedding a lot. We're gonna start with the bath. Oh my god. What's going on? Oh, right, okay. I thought you were going to carry him all the way. No, he's too heavy for me. Ready? Good boy. Can you get in there? Good boy. Oh. I was contemplating whether or not Ash was the biggest dog that I've ever washed, but we, I used to wash a dog um, called Sparky, who was a Caucasian Shepherd, but sadly he's passed away now. Here are some lovely videos that we have of Sparky. We've actually filmed Sparky's full groom, so if you want to watch it, just click in one of the corners. As Ash is a little compacted in his bum area and his tail, we're going to use a brush while he's wet and while he's lathered in conditioner and just kind of tease it out a little bit. Good boy. Oh yeah, that feels much better. Make it into a heart. Oh, oh, I thought it was going to shake. <laughs> oh. Good boy. You don't need many tools when you're blasting a double coated breed. The main tool is obviously the high velocity dryer which you saw. It helps blast out all of that undercoat making the next steps a lot easier when you move on to your brush and your comb. We're going to use these two products, well sorry, these two tools when we're using the stand dryer. Make sure that we brush, making sure that there's no knots, no compactedness and getting out more of the undercoat and then we're going to follow up with the comb. Now that he is all dry. We are moving on to the feet. So we're going to shave the pads, cut the nails, um, possibly trim around, make them look a little bit neater. Because Ash has arthritis and he's nine years old, I'm going to use the back harness to add support, but I'm also going to use my arm so that his body weight can lean on me while I lift his foot to do his other leg. So I'm just going to put it right underneath so it kind of leans on me. He's kind of sitting on my shoulder and then I'm just going to do his nails so there's more support. They are massive. Mm. Yeah. It smells all right actually. <laughs> Gentle. I'm just doing the pore wax, which helps with their overall pore health, but it helps with the cold and with any dry pads. As you saw, Ash is all wolf and no bite, so don't be scared if you get one of these in your salon, unless you have a salon built with straw.